Who was looking out for this little boy? His tiny body was found in a landfill last week, and now his aunt, the woman who was supposed to take care of him, is sitting in jail. But you know what's messed up here? Police say she wasted 19 precious hours when they possibly could have found the toddler alive. Yeah, Matt Howerton's been looking into this. Matt, Matt what, what happened during those missing hours? Well, it's all laid out here in these arrest documents. And simply put, for nearly one day, police say Crystal Jackson lied. She told investigators that someone abducted little CJ here overnight. But in reality, inside her home, he suddenly needed medical care, but never got it. The day is July 11th. No one has seen 18-month-old CJ Jackson for almost 24 hours, and his aunt, his guardian, Crystal Jackson, told police and WFAA someone abducted CJ from her home overnight. We all love that baby. He was just the sweetest little baby. But investigators now say she was lying and that CJ may still be alive if it weren't for her. After Jackson's interview, CJ was found in a landfill. Her boyfriend, Cedric Johnson, arrested. He told police he swaddled CJ before bed, but did it too tight, and that when the little boy started throwing up in the middle of the night, he became unresponsive. When things didn't get better after Johnson did CPR, he told police he drove CJ to a dumpster and left him inside. He wouldn't do that. Jackson denied it all and stuck to the story she told police. But then the FBI got involved, and when a special agent started asking Jackson questions, her story changed. Investigators say Jackson admitted to knowing CJ was gone hours before she reported him missing, and that she told Johnson and five other kids in the home to leave before she called 911. And here's the worst part. Jackson's arrest documents reveal a bombshell. Her boyfriend apparently did not say that CJ was deceased at the time he discarded him in the dumpster. And were it not for the actions and omissions by Jackson, CJ could have been located, potentially alive. Jackson was booked on a child endangerment charge. Her legal battle now begins. And so does the road to justice for this little boy. CJ's father and the brother of Jackson told me today he didn't want to comment that all of this was too much. He added that the family is still working on CJ's funeral arrangements.